Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm back. So today I've been coding and trying to finish up the tasks that I for my startup and I was trying to reach out to a few more people. So today's video is going to be about a tricks that I found will be useful when you are trying to learn programming yourself, especially if you are a self-taught. What I've discovered, you know, I have been coaching um, some people recently about how to get started in programming, um, getting started. And one of the most common mistakes that, 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 that I have observed um, amongst people are they are trying to follow the traditional rules like they are in college. Like as a self-taught, you cannot learn things like you are in college because because you don't know where to go. Like in college, you have someone to guide you, but when you are learning by yourself, you got to be aware of what makes you excited in learning. So today, I'm going to share a tips that might be helpful for you instead of just, just so, so instead of just keep watching to like youtube videos every day you have like a, people that like you are some experts and then they told you like hey you have to watch okay, this list of videos this list of tutorials and um, you just start to watch the first one and then after the first one for like an hour and then you were just like oh my god like there are like 10 more with two hours each how can i complete you are not in college you are learning by yourself and then i mentioned that just now one of the most important thing when you're trying to learn is to get yourself excited with the things that you're trying to learn so what makes you excited it's project yeah and then you'll be like yeah project i know what to build for I, I know i have to build projects i know what to build like like how do i get started like which project should i build i don't even know I, I don't even know how so i have to watch tutorial first i just don't don't know like so building projects it's the one way getting your hands dirty it's the most important thing when you're trying to learn to programming by yourself but yeah like where are you gonna get started like you don't have experience with that so what are you trying to build like you don't know how to build things like what are you trying to build the first and foremost the most important thing okay let me let me try and give you an example okay now you try to bake a cake okay you try to bake a cake and you don't know how to bake that of course first time you try to bake a strawberry shot cake okay you don't know how to do that me neither me neither so first you find you find ingredients on google or anywhere and or watch youtube videos okay you watch that i mean you are not just gonna like watch that after finishing that and then you build the cake you bake the cake without referencing the videos you of course you will be trying to build the cakes you're trying to knock things down and then you would as so you're trying to learn things here by yourself you just have to build things while referencing to the videos or the articles that you have been reading so copy and paste just copy and paste you have a look you read the articles you watch tutorials hey i'm gonna build this yeah it looks interesting i know the technologies i know i don't know how to build that so you follow along you take notes you write things down and then you just build that while referencing back to the videos and articles again make sure you understand how it's like baking a cake you need to make sure you understand why do you need to put this much of sugar why do you need to put this much of flour and the reason behind it why because it will mix because it will produce much better consistency of the flour the ingredients something like that you the the key here is not just to copy and paste the whole thing into your code you need to understand referencing back to that project and this is how you build a project in programming when you're trying to be a self-taught not like oh i get an idea i mean unless you have experience in building i know where did i find this <laughs> unless you have experience in building then yes you can build that project yourself but if you have no idea if you have no idea how to build things then you just have to reference that back and forth copy and paste what they did make sure you understand that and that's the key to make sure you understand how to build a project but yeah, i don't know where they get it it's it's cute but yeah so that's it that's the, the tips that i want to give it to you when you're trying to build a project don't just follow tutorials along just make sure you follow along while building the project 
referencing it back and forth and that's it for today tips i hope you have learned something if you like this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you have any questions put down below i will make sure if you want me to create like a list of projects that if you want to create like a list of projects for your for you to reference let me know down in the comment below and i will make sure to create one in the future and that's it for today i hope you have learned something from me and keep building love for more